Next event on the track, the women's 400 meter final. But after nine events, the team standings, Kansas still that six point lead over Arizona State, then Stanford just one point back now as we get ready for this 400 meters. Monique Henderson, the Olympic gold medalist, collegiate record and NCAA record. Phyllis Francis of Oregon yesterday, I thought she looked like Wilma Rudolph in that four by 400 semi. She was terrific and she is. This is kind of her event. She's tall, lanky, has awesome talent. The home crowd will go crazy. This woman has been an Olympian already, just 19 years of age. Shawnee Miller, a freshman from the Bahamas and Georgia. A woman who competed for Nigeria in the Olympic Games from the University of Arkansas. Look at that 15-time All-American, Regina George. And this is the defending champion, Ashley Spencer. She won the title as a freshman, and she knows she has her hands full. But this young lady has already got the title under her belt. She knows what she has to do, and she told us about it the other day. You know, I honestly, I don't really worry about um, anyone else in my race because that's not going to help me uh, run any faster. Um, Shawnee Miller and Regina George, they are wonderful athletes. They're very good competitors. They're very talented. And just running with them, um, just get, it's an honor and it's, it's, a it's really a blessing to me to run against these girls. Um, I know they've been working hard and I've worked hard and I know what I need to do to win. So I just try to focus on my focus. Gina George in her last collegiate race in five, and then the defending champion, Ashley Spencer, the son of Illinois in six. Sensational talent on the track right now. And Ashley Spencer, two ladies Ashley outside. Spencer, yeah, but so is Shawnee Miller. We watched her all year long in the SEC meet. She's in the middle of the track for Georgia. These women try and run about 23 and a half seconds for the first 200 meters, half a lap around the track. Regina George, a gutty, gritty competitor for Arkansas. And just inside here, Shawnee Miller about to make the turn. You can almost not separate these four. Francis a step behind the others, and Spencer a step in front. Here comes Shawnee Miller. Can Spencer hold her up? Now, here comes Phyllis Francis. Almost a blanket finish, but now Spencer, she will repeat. The sophomore wins it for the second time in a row. Sensational time, 50.29 seconds. Only four women in the world have run faster. Not just collegians, four women in the world have run faster. Just tremendous time. All three women, first three women under 51 seconds. Let's take a look at this. Down the home stretch, all put themselves in position to win. And the smoothest of the three coming in, Ashley Spencer. I talked with a coach last year, I didn't even know what he said. Where do you see Spencer's ability? She's so young, and boy, she keeps performing at an amazing level up against women who have competed in the Olympics. Ashley Spencer had the toughest lane draw everybody can draw for, but she repeats as NCAA champion, and she's with Lewis. White, I'm most curious to know how tough was it was to defend this championship with this tough field? Very tough. All the girls are very talented. They've been working hard, so it was very tough. 200 meters to go, it was almost a blanket finish. That's the way they called it upstairs. What allowed you to separate at the end? My heart. I wanted this so bad. I worked hard and it came out with the win. All right, excellent one. Congratulations. Thank you. Dwight? All right, Lewis. Well, I got to tell you, that was a tough way to go. She's got the crowd favorite inside her. She's got the fantastic freshman. She's got the incredible veteran. And she holds off everyone to win her second consecutive title.